Hey everyone and welcome to my kitchen. Um, I'm here because I'm eating my pre-workout meal, getting ready to train. Uh, pre-workout meal for the day, three ounces of lean ground beef, a cup of rice, and a handful of greens. This is the first time I'm eating carbs today and it's like almost five o'clock. So I'm super stoked to be eating rice. And I'm also drinking a Monster. This is the Monster Zero, so there's no calories. And it's like the citrus flavor, which is perfect because it's like 85 degrees in Daly City, California, which is absolutely unheard of. But I wanted to shoot an intro for my Klokov inspired workout. As you may or may not know, I recently went to a Klokov seminar in Santa Cruz where he did kind of lay out for all of us what the Russian weightlifting team did on a weekly basis as far as training goes. So I'm just going to give you an overview and then I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the exercises that he discussed in detail. So Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, the Russian weightlifting team will do a snatch workout in the morning and a clean workout at night. And on Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, they would do more of like a strength workout where they do their back squats and pulling and presses and stuff like that. So that's what I'll show you guys in the video. He did say, however, that sets and reps do not matter, that people should be doing a variety of reps and sets. Keep that in mind when you're creating your workout program. Sometimes throwing in sets of five, eight, or 10 are a good thing for you. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and don't forget to subscribe for more awesome content. Thank you. Starting with muscle snatches as a warm up and just really focusing on getting my elbows nice and high and keeping the bar close to my body. Here's my friend Dario joining me on those muscle snatches and he's only been lifting for about six months. Next exercise on the list is a snatch variation and here I'm just doing a pause hang snatch, pausing at the knee for about five seconds. It's really important to focus on perfect position and exploding at the hips. So next is a snatch grip deadlift variation. Here I'm doing that off a deficit, just off of a couple of 25 pound plates. And once again, focusing on positioning, keeping my butt down and my chest up. Next is Klokov's famous move, the trap high pull. He recommends doing this five sets of five every single day, just focusing on that muscle memory, and only do this with a snatch grip while using straps with light weight. Okay, last exercise of this session is a snatch grip press variation. Here I'm just doing a snatch grip sots press behind the neck. This exercise is so great for just getting comfortable in that bottom snatch position. Now starting on that evening session focusing on clean related movements, I am starting off with a muscle clean as my warm up. to a clean and jerk variation here I am doing a pause clean at the knee and once again pausing at the dip of the jerk once again with these very important to hold those positions and explode and now for a clean grip deadlift variation I'm just doing your typical clean deadlift So 
I had to include handstand push-ups in this video because Klokop absolutely swears by them, although he does them from a deficit, which I'm not able to do just yet. So we're starting the strength workout with a press variation, and here I'm doing five reps of push presses. Next on the list is a deadlift variation of some sort, and once again I'm doing a snatch grip deadlift as that's what I need to work on the most, so just using light weight and working through each position slowly. After deadlifts, we're moving on to squats, and here I'm doing three front squats, with the last one being a pause rep. And Klokov recommends that you front squat twice a week and back squat once a week. And finishing off with jump squats with weight, Klokov recommends that you do this every single time after you squat for five sets of ten. 